Hi guys, welcome to our channel. In the current pandemic situation, there is one thing that we all are looking for. That is the treatment for COVID-19 infection. And according to the latest update, Drugs Controller General of India, that is the DCGI, has granted permission for emergency use of the drug 2-deoxy-D glucose. So let us understand about this anti-COVID-19 therapeutic application of the drug 2-deoxy-D glucose. So who developed it? This drug was developed by Institute of Nuclear Medicine and Allied Science, a lab of DRDO in collaboration with Dr. Reddy's laboratory, Hyderabad. So where is this drug being used? This 2-DG drug is to be used as a supplemental therapy in moderate to severe COVID-19 patients. Make a note that this drug is not to be used in mild cases of COVID-19 infection. So what is 2-DG? It is a generic molecule and analogue of glucose which means it is similar to glucose in our body. So basically it can be easily produced and made available in abundance. This 2-deoxy-D glucose is a glucose molecule which has two hydroxyl group replaced by hydrogen so that it cannot undergo further glycolysis. So here in this DRDO published image, you can see the comparison between virus multiplication in COVID-19 infection. The virus multiplication in patient treated with 2-DG is very less. On similar mechanism, this drug was under clinical trial for cancer treatment along with chemotherapy. So now what does glycolysis do? Basically glycolysis is a series of reaction that extracts energy from glucose. So when 2-DG is given to the patient, it stops the cell growth. How to take 2-DG? This drug comes in a powder form in sachet. It is taken orally by dissolving it in water. Let's see how it works. You can see two types of cell here. One is virus infected and the other one is normal cell. 2-DG only accumulates in the virus infected cells and prevents the virus growth by stopping viral synthesis and energy production. Its selective accumulation in virally infected cells makes this drug unique. Clinical trial results have shown that this molecule helps in faster recovery of hospitalized patients and reduces the supplemental oxygen dependence. So this drug is believed to be showing promising result. Hope you liked our video. Share this information with your loved ones. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.